MD News Network recently attended the Medical Group Management Association's annual conference in New Orleans, where our cameras focused on multiple healthcare information technology vendors. Here's what they had to say. Allscripts is a publicly traded company. Uh, we have 5,500 employees, uh, but more importantly, we have 180,000 physicians, 1,500 hospitals, and 10,000 post-acute care facilities that are using our products to change how healthcare is delivered, uh, not only from a clinical perspective, but also from a revenue cycle or financial perspective as well. And, and both sides are equally important as the market begins a shift toward really creating a connection between those two parts. Uh, one of the things which has been clear here at MGMA this year is that the market is changing. Uh, this concept of accountable care organizations is a very hot concept. Uh, the concept of medical homes is a growing concept. Uh, but ultimately, what it means is that quality, in many ways, is becoming the new currency. And the, and the ability for a provider to deliver outcomes is more relevant now than ever. And our vision is to create a connected community of health by bringing all of these different constituents together, whether they're in our network or outside of our network, uh, to bring continuity of care and simplify things for not only uh, patients but also for providers. The beauty of integration in today's world is as a software as a service type of provider, we can do most of that between on a vendor to vendor basis and we don't make the, the, the healthcare provider or the doctor's staff try to integrate because it's just not really that, that that's not their skill set. So uh, for the most part, we're, we're living in a world today where data as a service is, is a very common theme among and between a lot of the vendors that we see here today at the show, most of whom we work with at some level or, or another. I think what you'll find is that our solutions help to, to further the patient-centric focus that a physician naturally has. Because we have things like portals, which help with communication and sharing of information, the patient is much more involved in decision making. And it also helps them as far as affordability, making sure tests aren't duplicated, making sure they don't have to go through painful tests unnecessarily. It's a win-win all around. We all know that claims processing and, and getting paid is complicated. And one of, one of the things that we do is we focus in on making it as easy as possible. Uh, one of the keys is that no matter what we do, these transactions are going to have a 15, 20, 30 percent rejection. And how you get those cleaned up and how you get them reprocessed is really what improves accounts receivable. From my perspective as a physician, I'm looking for something that's uh, it's all self-contained. It's one package. Uh, I know that, that it's all, I got, so to speak, one throat to choke, you use an old terminology. It, it's, it, I can go to a company that handles everything that's part of my, my problem, uh, not where I'm going to get referred to uh, an e-prescribing module or going to get e or, or referred to a, a company that deals with uh, reporting, for instance, or scheduling, something that, where my staff doesn't spend a lot of time trying to get solutions solved uh, or problems solved because they're sorting around trying to figure out who who belongs to where. So I think that that's a big thing about being able to be a, a one complete solution. It's It really cuts down the headaches, the concerns, the anxiety that a lot of practices have. Uh, you have a one-to-one -one relationship. If you go back into the world of energy and utilities, even banking, they all started with the world of, I'm going to go buy an, ER, an ERP, I'm going to do SAP, I'm going to do J.D. Edwards, Oracle. And they said, that will be everything to me. It will be my accounting, it will be my HR, it will be my workflow, it will be how I manage inventory. And they went through long and expensive million and billion dollar projects only to land on the other end of it to say, guys, we've made a mistake. We now need to go get an HR system that more effectively helps us do HR. I love my accounting system. I love my document management world that SAP or whomever has provided me, but I sure want choice. And therefore, they started to go break and split the baby in half. And all of a sudden, the world of interfaces, integration became key. Um, and we're gonna see that in healthcare. We're gonna see the fact that everybody, everybody in this room has bullet points that address many, many different things. But the fact of the matter is some people do those bullet points good some people do them great, and some people do them poorly. But at the end of the day, the people that do that one good bullet point great and can learn how to work and play well with others, play in the sandbox, they're gonna be successful. And they're gonna help drive standardization in the market, which we really think will come.
you really have to decide what you and your practice can afford both from a technology standpoint, as well as a skills standpoint, as well as a financial standpoint. So for some people, that means that they have their own IT staff to help support them. For others, they don't. So then that's when a hosted or a cloud offering is a really important aspect for them. So it really comes down to sitting down with whoever your, per, your vendor is and really deciding based on your needs, what's the best solution for you? And everybody should have options. Um, and it's that menu of options to choose from that I think is important. As a lifelong information technologist, one of the things that I marvel at is how little we've invested in information technology and healthcare. I believe in terms of care, we have fantastic products, right, in terms of imaging and all those sorts of things. So if you haven't invested in the last five years, there's an awful lot of innovation and change. And a lot of it comes with, you know, kind of the just-in-time inventory that we've seen in manufacturing. Well, now we have simpler solutions that are more dynamic. They get you the response and the information that you need, whether it's in the business analytics or whether your patient has coverage, whether you have a $50 deductible and you can get that all real-time using um, modern technology in terms of uh, the types of solutions that are being generated these days so if you haven't looked at it in three or four years there's all kinds of new innovations whether it's you know from handhelds to laptops to uh, simple solutions back in the day we thought about changing our technology and it scared us because everything in the office was going to have to change now the solutions are actually easier than they've ever been before so now is a great time to go back and relook at best of breed or a specific problem in your office that you're trying to solve for. Regarding innovation, the most exciting thing that, that we see is that our clients are now driving it. Uh, so we've created a, a platform called My All Scripts where our clients can come into the community and they can tell us what they want and need and then other clients can vote on what they think is either a good or bad idea. Uh, so really the community is driving the innovation. Now with that said, there's also an ecosystem of partners out there that are operating on the fringe that are driving some incredible ideas. One a thing that we're showing on the floor this year at MGMA is Intuit um, Quick and Health and the ability for um, Intuit to bring what has been incredible innovation in terms of making some pretty complex concepts, pretty simple online for consumers to healthcare. And so now we're driving that through our application. So um, from a platform perspective, there's a usability uh, issue um, or opportunity. And then there's also a technology platform opportunity. You'll see a, a lot of um, uh, interest in the cloud and putting things uh, in a format where you don't have to have the servers necessarily on site. And we provide that service uh, for, for clients who want and need that. And then you're seeing a lot of interest in uh, terms of some of the new hardware. So a lot of interest on the iPad, the iPhone, and Allscripts uh, applications have been customized to work and to be optimized in those environments.